Did you know that Clementine was my grandfather's? Yeah. Uh, he named it after his mother. Oh, boy. He was a very strict man. But I always found him reasonable. <laughs> and he had a policy. He would only kill if it was absolutely necessary for food, or to vanquish an enemy, or to eliminate an incompetent imbecile. Mistakes were made. It won't happen again. Oh, I know it won't. Who? Oh. <laughs> That's a real dramatic, real dramatic clip. <laughs> We're back with Brian Clanson. Uh, that was a clip from Argyle. Um, a great cast. Rob Delaney was in that. Yeah. Clip. Another great uh, yeah. comedian and actor. Funny. Uh, Dua Lipa, my, my good friend Dua Lipa was in the film. I heard. Yeah. And saw that uh, that clip of you. Yeah. You were imbibing a little bit. We I imbibed. Think. You were imbibing. You, now you did not have a scene with Dua, so you don't no. know uh, that she's a bully. Is she really? Yeah, she bullied me into getting my first tattoo. She, through what? What was her 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 way into bullying you? She is Dua Lipa, and she asked. That is. That is. <laughs> That's yeah. that's horrible. That's horrible. Of her. Horrible. What else was I gonna say? Yes. You now you got a, a tattoo uh, with Aaron Paul. Matching tattoos. Yeah, well, they're not, they're not matching okay, tattoos. Okay, gotcha. Um, the, the last day of production, 11 years ago, uh, I got a tattoo on my hand, but you can't see it. Okay. Because an actor, I don't want to have it social. Yeah, yeah. But I, I did get it right there. Oh, my, very good. There's right, the, yeah, the BB. Right there. there you go. It's the symbol for uh, Breaking Bad. And someone said, uh, wh why put it there? You, No one else can see it. And I said, well, it's, it's not really for someone else. It's, it's for me. Yeah. And, and when I catch it, I, I remember the, the times that we had on this wonderful show. Do you want to see my, my matching tattoo? I do. I want to see your tattoo. Okay. Here we go. Ready? Yeah. You guys got it over there? Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Ah! <laughs> very nice. There we go. Very her call. nice. Her call, not mine. Yeah. No, actually, here's, uh, here's the real one right there. It's that. And uh, No, I, th I, I think that's just a mole. Yeah. Well, guess what? My, uh, John Oliver, who's a very cruel person, yeah. uh, he said it looks like a tick. Yeah. <laughs> so that's like the, the rest of every summer, the rest of my life, my wife's going to be like, check yes. for ticks. And I'm like, it's not a now, tick. Now, it's kind of a personal thing. So yeah. a, a very a, attractive young woman yeah. convinces you to get a, a matching tattoo. Yeah. What, what did your wife say about that? We, you know what? It's funny. We're trying not to talk about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I won't bring it up. I'm sorry I brought it up. I mean, I feel like... There, we, we talk about it like non-verbally with a lot of size. Yeah, and yeah. looks and a side eye. Look, a lot of looks and a lot of size. Now, of course, uh, mine is a, is a temporary tattoo, uh, but a lot of people did get Heisenberg tattoos. Oh, God. And you've got to uh, learn over oh. the years. I mean, these are intense. Yeah, that's on an arm. That's on an arm. Like an RV and everything. Uh, that's on a, a neck. That's a neck. Yeah, it's like pulling. This is, a, this is a fun one just on the back of a head. Yeah, he carved it out on his head. Yeah, and then this one, this is, well, that's, I mean, that's just a human butt. That's, uh, <laughs> that's on a butt. Now, if you look closely to this, uh, on the left, you see Larry, and Mo <laughs> is down below. Yeah. So I'm actually the third stooge <laughs> on someone's ass. I just like, there's some lady out there who loves Breaking Bad and the Stooges yeah. and saw this guy's butt and is like, he's a keeper. He's a stooge. <laughs> he's yeah, the guy. They actually must have thought I was Curly. <laughs> yeah. was like, oh, he's bald. That's Curly. Uh, you got to work uh, uh, in the film, uh, not only with great actors, but there's a cat named Alfie. Yeah. Oh, no. It did not go well. I hate that cat. <laughs> that cat thinks he's, oh, big show business now. He's stealing every scene. He, you, you know what? He walks down the hall. You, you're, you're not supposed to look him directly in the eye. Really? I mean, it's like you're supposed to... He's got his agents following him around and everything. I mean, I will say that's problematic, because even unfamous cats are ass <laughs> So you're, they're all starting at a place of the worst. They're the worst, yeah. and they get even worse. <laughs> than the, yes. Was Alfie the name? Uh, 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 that's the cat's name. Well, the, real, the, the name of the real cat okay. is Chip. Okay, gotcha. And Chip is is um, uh, owned by a, a, a supermodel. Yeah, isn't that the? So yeah. this Claudia Schiffer right there. Yes. And that's so Chip the cat actually gets carried around in this case. Yes, carried around. 
I, I would like to be carried around yeah. in a case like that. In, spec, in fact, by Claudia Schiffer. I would like to yeah. call in the case. Um, actually, the, and that's where, you know, they talked about uh, the Taylor Swift. There was rumor that Taylor Swift uh, wrote Argyle. And uh -huh. I, while I cannot deny or confirm that, uh, apparently Taylor Swift has a cat in a, in in a, a cat carrier ah. like that. And so they thought there was a tie-in to it. Gotcha. Now, yeah. this must have been the hardest acting you've ever done. You had to actually act and hold the same case. Yes. Yeah. Um, and I'm, I'm allergic to cats. Yeah. I'm, uh, well, I'm mostly allergic to the musical cats. Yeah. But... A lot of people. That's but, one of the more common allergies. Yeah. Uh, uh, but also, the actual <laughs> feline yeah. uh, it, it makes my eyes water. Um, yeah, I, my character doesn't like cats. And so he, he mistreated the fake cat. Uh -huh. We had real cat and fake cat. Chip was not only treated like a star that he yeah. is. Uh, uh, he was on the phone during the breaks calling Scorsese, and, and <laughs> right. you know, it's like, uh, what, what's next for me? And on speaker, right? So you could on all speaker, hear. On speaker, so we're like, <laughs> we know you got it's connections. So Jim. classless. Well, again, uh, it speaks to you as an actor that I've only heard great things about how you interacted with Chip, who you clearly hate. I clearly hate him. Yeah, yeah, but but you know, he is the star of this movie. Yeah, which I. I'm uh, very sad about. <laughs> the movie is fun, however. The movie is fun. Oh my God, it's so much fun. Uh, and thanks for being here. It's always so much fun to thanks. see you. Good always such you. a pleasure. You guys, you. Brian Cranston, Argyle, theaters and IMAX, February 2nd. Stick around, be right back with Lola Tongue.